Hey folks, it's John P. here, and you know we've been talking a lot about tablets, but tablets have one big problem. We're going to talk about that now. This episode of Geek Beat TV is brought to you by Dice.com, the career hub for tech. So I'm here with Peter from LensPen, and you know what, I've been using lens pens for a while on my camera lenses. But I have a problem, Peter. I've got this tablet, it's a Samsung, and it is filthy. I keep pulling rags out of my pocket, trying to get the uh, fingerprint oil off of here, and it just doesn't work for me. And I think you've got a solution for us. Can you tell me about it? Great. Thank you, John. Uh, our company, LensPen, makes products for one purpose only, to remove fingerprints. And we do that in a very special way. We use carbon. No, no liquids, no cloths, no sprays, no tissues. Not high tech, old tech. My mother used to use newspaper to clean windows and mirrors in the house when I was a kid. And why did that work? Because the newspaper was covered with printer's ink and the printer's ink is about 25% carbon. The carbon did all the work. So our product here, a Sidekick, has a spring activated cleaning pad. We're simply gonna, the, the screening pad is covered with carbon. We're simply going to, go like that. I'll clean part of your, you can see before, and after. Wow. It looks like, I mean, it looks like it came out of the package now. Now, where's the fingerprint oil? The fingerprint oil is here, absorbed by the carbon on the tip. What am I going to do? I'm going to close this baby up. Now, when I've closed it up, I've actually recharged it and make it ready to clean again. There's a little foam pad here on the side filled with carbon. So that's charging motion in and out, replenishes the carbon on the tip to clean again. And it'll give us about how many? About 150 cleanings from one of these. Now, you're not going to count to 150 like I had to. You're going to just notice that it doesn't seem to clean anymore because it's used up all the carbon. So now you're simply going to replace the cleaning pads. We sell these separately. Buy the applicator and the cleaning pad, and away you go. Our carbon does not care whether you're in Arctic cold or desert heat, and there's no expiry date. <laughs> Put this unit down, lose it, find it three years later, as good as the day you put it down. Very nice. And now, availability. I think these things are brand new, right? Can we get them yet? You, John, you're going to be getting one today. Well, very nice. And Pally and other friends will be getting one because we have them here at the show. But these but how just about came... all those other people out there? <laughs> I'm saying March because it takes that long for orders to get produced and delivered from our factory and get in stores. Okay. This is, I think, an example of the right product at the right time. No liquids, no cloths, no tissues, as green as you can get. No tissues to keep throwing away, no sprays, no empty bottles. Naturally made product, carbon on earth. Excellent, excellent, thank you very much. Well, you know what? Um, we need to say thank you to our sponsors who brought us here to get this excellent coverage right up, right up front. Thanks so much to Dice.com for sponsoring our CES coverage. Gotta love them. They are the place to go if you are looking for a job in tech. And they are running a very cool contest called the Best Interview Ever. If you win, you get to take a trip to New York, you get to win $25,000, and you get to talk to some really, really cool tech companies. Go to Dice.com slash contest for more information. So the last little bit of information, a starter kit's gonna come with one of the cleaning units and one replacement for 20 bucks. And then when you're, after you've run through 300 cleanings, I guess, you can buy a refill pack, three of these for 15 bucks. Very reasonable. For more of the live coverage from CES, go to youtube.com forward slash geekbeat TV. And of course, later we'll have it all up on geekbeat.tv. Take care. For more coverage from CES, go to geekbeat TV forward slash, I'm sorry.